When I began working in the bishop's office seven years ago, it felt to me that the diocesan office represented the principal's office to most people in clergy. There was a sense of fear, of suspicion. Anytime I picked up the phone to make a call, one of my coworkers would have to give me background on that person and explain why he or she might not be receptive to hearing from me. It could be a little nerve wracking. I'm sure that some people still view us as the principal's office, but I would say that there is far more warmth and far less mistrust than when I started. From the outset, Bishop Gregg and his wife, Laura Lee, placed a tremendous emphasis on the ministry of hospitality. One of my first assignments was coordinating a series of weekly dinners for our diocesan priests and their spouses at the Brewer's home. I think these gatherings were a huge stepping stone towards fostering collegiality among clergy from very diverse backgrounds. Bishop Brewer has also looked for opportunities to weave fellowship into some of our annual meetings, like beginning the tradition of having a Friday night dinner at our diocesan convention and making sure there are plenty of windows of time at the fall clergy conference for meals and downtime together. Connecting one-on-one -on -one with the clergy and people of the diocese is extremely important to Bishop Gregg. I would say that at least half of his appointments are relationship focused. Whether it be a breakfast catch-up session with the rector of one of our churches or linking up with the seminarian for coffee while he's on the road, Bishop Brewer is happiest when he is spending time with people. When your leader values relationships the way that Bishop Brewer does, that is going to be reflected diocesan-wide. As someone who grew up in the Diocese of Central Florida, it gives me a great sense of comfort and pride to see the way our diocesan family is stronger than ever. Thanks to Bishop Brewer's emphasis on relationship building throughout his episcopacy, I think we can all feel hopeful about the future.